Hey everybody, it's T. Maria here. I have a great recipe for you. It's chicken Mozambique. If you like shrimp Mozambique, you're going to love this easy recipe too. All right, so the ingredients are, I have about two pounds of chicken tenderloins. I marinated them with some paprika, salt, garlic powder, a little black pepper, a little cumin if you want, that's optional. And I have a small diced onion. I have four cloves of garlic, finely diced, one chicken bouillon cube. I'm gonna use about a half stick of butter, a half a cup of white wine, a half a cup of uh, chicken broth, and I have about, oh, maybe three to four tablespoons of pdp PD sauce. We can use any uh, hot sauce. All right, so let's get started. So I like to grill these tenderloin first. I think it gives a better flavor. Now these are going to take probably uh, two, six minutes, maybe eight minutes. Okay, so I'm starting my Mozambique sauce. I'm sauteing a small diced onion and about two to three tablespoons of olive oil. It's getting nice and slightly golden. I'm gonna add my garlic powder, I'm sorry, my garlic, <laughs> and minced garlic. Now this is going to saute for probably a minute or two so it gets nice and, nice and uh, soft and golden. All right, next I'm going to add my white wine. We have my chicken broth chicken bouillon cube. This is all going to blend in nicely. It's going to melt. So we're going to add some butter. Probably the half a stick of butter, four tablespoons of butter. And what but the butter does, it makes it, it makes the sauce nice and thick. So this is going to melt down. So I'm adding some peaty peat sauce, which probably a couple tablespoons of pdp you can use any brand if you don't have pdp use some hot sauce that works too okay so this is going to cook down a little bit it's going to get really thick so meanwhile i have cooked my chicken breasts i grilled them slightly and i'm going to add them to the sauce all right so the sauce as you can see it's getting thicker going to reduce a little bit more then I'm going to add that chicken. All right so now I'm adding about a tablespoon more of paprika. It's going to give it that beautiful golden reddish color. It's going to intensify the flavor. So the sauce as you can see, see it makes a white line the bottom of the pan. That tells you that it's thicker. So I'm going to add my, my chicken. I'm going to lower the heat because this is going to simmer. So this chicken is going to be delicious. You can smell that, that hot sauce, the pd pd. You can smell that wine is reducing. It's going to be delicious. Now some people, they cook the chicken raw right in the sauce. But I like a little texture in the chicken. I think grilling it first gives it a little more texture. Simmering away. Oh, it smells delicious. All right. So I'm going to be making sandwiches today, but you can serve this over some nice white rice, some french fries, even pasta. Okay, so this is going to simmer probably another maybe five to eight minutes until it gets nice, nice and full of that sauce. Okay. Hey, everybody. Our chicken Mozambique is done. It looks delicious. Can you see the chunky pieces of garlic and onion? I like the sauce very chunky. It's delicious. I have extra dipping sauce on the side if you want. I also made a chicken sandwich with a Portuguese English muffin. Okay, so I hope you enjoy it. And then you again, you can serve this with white rice. It'd be great. Even some pasta and some, how about some french fries? So enjoy the recipe. Thank you.